Today we're going to explore the effects of sulfur hexafluoride, a gas which has earned itself the nickname the anti-helium. <laughs> So why do they call it the anti-helium? That's because it's way heavier than air. Air is about 79% nitrogen, 21% oxygen, a little bit of argon, and it weighs about what we call in science 29 atomic mass units. The sulfur in sulfur hexafluoride weighs more than air. Tack on six fluorines, you got something that weighs about 5.03 times heavier than air. Why does it make your voice so deep? When you make noise with your vocal cords, you're basically vibrating air molecules. And the mass of the air molecules or other gases matters. Kind of like with the spring, okay? I'm going to attach this weight to the spring. And it will oscillate at what we call in science a certain frequency. That's how many cycles per second. And it would be about one cycle per second. Now, let me take a mass that is five times heavier. This would be like sulfur hexafluoride to air. And when I let it go, you can see much, much lower frequency. And now when you make sound with your vocal cords, you're making the pitch. And the high frequency is high pitch, and the low frequency is low pitch. And kind of like the spring. Except, you, you know, you shouldn't have springs in your vocal cords. If you do, you should go to the doctor. <laughs> So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn on this tank of sulfur hexafluoride. This is a fish aquarium. All the fish have been removed for their safety. And as you see, as this starts to fill from the bottom up, because it's way heavier than air, you'll see that candle start to struggle. And yeah, there it goes. Not able to stay. This balloon should start to float as well. There it goes. That's going to help me know what my level is. If I do this right, I can actually make this aluminum foil. Nope, not yet. If I do this right, I should be able to make it. Nope, not yet. <laughs> All right, now this really freaked me out when I first did it. If I do this right, I think I don't have this thing full yet, but I didn't do it this long last time, so it kind of making me wonder if my boat sucks. All right, when I first tried this, it really freaked me out. But I should be able to. Yeah, there it is. Ow! Look at it, it was floating just for a little while. Now I'm causing too many air currents. There it is. Floating aluminum foil. I can do better. Just 140 more tries. How's your battery? <laughs> and if I do it right, I might be able to make it. There it goes. There it is. All right. And now I can sink the boat by carefully scoop some out, pour it in. It's like magic, right? Except there is no magic. There's only science. Magic isn't real. Science is the truth. Magic is just lies. All lies. <laughs> and there's only one way to make sure you get the sulfur hexafluoride out of your lungs. Thanks for watching Science with Mike. <laughs>